Who's the man in the mirror? When you look in the mirror, who's staring back at you? When you look yourself in the eyes in the mirror, who are you talking to? And that's what we're gonna be talking about in today's video. This is Devin Cripe with DC Fitness and my Spartan Gods. And today, we're talking about who is the man in the mirror, all right? When you look in the mirror, when you look at your body, what does it scream? What is it telling you, all right? Is it screaming? hard work, dedication, d discipline, consistency, persistence, all of the virtues and qualities of a strong, virtuous, hard, disciplined man that any woman would be lucky to have, that any purpose would be accomplished by this man? Or are you looking at a man that's screaming soft, insecure, doubtful, low self-worth, compromises, undisciplined, lazy, no work ethic. What are you looking at your body? Because really your body is a mere reflection of your habits, of your disciplines, of your character, of your virtues and qualities. It is screaming. And as, as you do one thing, we know that you do everything. So if you're soft and, and squishy and look undisciplined on the outside, that's how most likely you are internally, meaning that's how you treat your relationships, that's how you treat your job and your business, that's how you treat the other areas of your life. But if you look at your mirror and you see that man that you wanna be, that's how you're gonna show up to your wife and your kids, your girlfriend, your, mo your mother, your father, your coworkers, your employees, your clients, your members, your purpose, God, the universe, the, the world, the community. That's how you're gonna show up. Because as you do one thing, you do everything because it is established as a habit, right? So what we're talking about today is where are you right now? Being the word truth, what is the truth? Where are you right now? in every single area of life. Because first and foremost, you need to take care of your body and your mind and your own emotions before you can take care of other people. You must fill your own cup before you can fill others' cups. If you're not in the best physical, mental, and emotional, and spiritual shape you possibly could be, how could you be the best father and husband and a boss and entrepreneur and business owner that you could be if you're if you aren't taking care of you first and foremost right and that's what we do here at dc fitness and my spartan gods that's how, how we help men is by conquering yourself breaking those bad habits breaking those vices right becoming the man that you are destined to be being and becoming that is the purpose being and becoming the best you in every single moment in every given moment purpose over pleasure right that's how we do it, okay? And anytime you break your word, you break your integrity, you know it, and you know that you're not tapped in, you know that you don't feel your greatest. And I know this from experience, because you and I are not different, you and I are the same. You and I and every single human being on this earth is the same, on this internal basis of what we know is right and wrong, what we know is hard work and lazy, what we know is discipline and undisciplined. What we know that we can be and we're settling to be. We know this within ourselves, And we also know that nobody is perfect. Okay? J somebody might just be more disciplined or work harder or bo be more consistent or took more risks, studied more, learned more, applied more. Right? Those are the, that's the only difference between anybody in this whole entire planet. Right? They, you might have been dealt a different set a hand of cards, different situation, different parents, different country, different this, different that. You might not start at the same starting line, but the only thing separating you between a different individual is how hard they work, their character, their discipline, their consistency, their persistence, the knowledge they know, the people they know. And these are all things that once you take responsibility that you can acquire and work towards becoming, right? The only, re the only reason, the only thing that's holding you back is yourself with a victim mentality, right? But that's a different topic for a different video. So the main process of this video is when you look in the mirror, what is screaming back at you? Are you a man of your word? Are you a man of integrity? 
Are you doing what you said you were going to do? Or are you continuously settling in your comfort zone, settling for average and mediocrity, mediocrity, not settling, settling and not be, being and becoming your best in every single area? Or are you looking yourself in the eyes and being like, I'm proud of myself. I'm, I'm the man. I'm a boss. I keep going. I'm a savage. I'm unstoppable. I'm breakable. Because you keep on showing up every single day to be and become your best in every single given moment with everything you do.